morning everyone you guys might see a different background this morning yes we are on our second home on wheels it is located in our baker backyard here at home if you're not yet subscribed to autism royalty family make sure to do so hit that big thumbs up the bell notification to get notified every time we upload a brand new video Yes, guys, I'm all getting new than everything. I just woke up. Well, actually, not really woke up because I didn't sleep at all. I was just, like, on and off. I don't know if it was because we are at our RV. Um, we decided to sleep here last night because um, we haven't had time to go camping. We decided to sleep back here. It's still, you know, at home, but it feels like if you're camping because we are in our home on wheels second home on wheels guys and that feels so so good this is ashley's and i's room and the reason i say ashley and i because me and her stay on this bed and i'll give you guys a little tour just in case you guys haven't seen our other blogs it's like a full-on home guys it's really really cool um i look all messed up i did break out a lot maybe because i just wiped my face a little bit um i didn't wash my face last night this is my bare skin guys but i do have some breakouts there it's kind of annoying but anyway um you guys have seen me in every which way um yeah we haven't had time to go camping guys because for one thing or another the girls have been booked like every weekend because it's full-on wrestling season alia's not wrestling at this time because i didn't want her to wrestle for her current school um, yes, I did say that. It's me. I didn't let her wrestle. But she's still going to support. I'm still going to support in Alize's coaching. We decided to stay here for that type of reason because we miss going camping. Um, so it feels like if we're camping, Willie went inside the house right now because we didn't bring everything. We just brought our stuff to sleep. And we actually have stuff here already in the cabinets, like the blankets and all that. Um, the girls did um, come home not that late last night so they came to the rv and they cleaned it up a little bit swept mop and that kind of thing so yeah guys um you guys might have seen the previous vlog yesterday um my mom did have an accident she fell really really badly guys really badly it sounded like a car crash in my wall um she did hit her head on the wall and then reboto. she landed on the floor i got to see that part through the window um willie's gonna go ahead and check the cameras i'm not sure the camera got it or not he's trying to figure it out it was really bad so yesterday she said you know she was fine which i get it you know when you when you're in a car crash or even when you wrestle you don't feel the pain right away until like the next day or a few days later so i think this was her case um she didn't feel anything till the night she was complaining about a rib hurting and she has a chipotle right here i'm gonna go inside the house right now um i'll go ahead and interview her a little bit my sister's gonna take her she's the one that's more familiar if you guys question like oh how come you're not taking her um usually i you know like a few years ago she did get sick and my sister was in charge of taking her since she lives with me and i do everything else for her but of course i don't have to explain myself um to anyone but um just so you guys know it's not that i don't want to take her it's that my sister's already familiar with the hospital she goes to the a doctor that actually helped her out when she got pneumonia like five years ago so she's pretty familiar and of course if she needs help with her kids um if her husband's not available she can leave them to me always so but in this case it, it is sunday so she she's gonna leave him with her husband because he is off work but like i mentioned if he wouldn't be off she would leave him with me um so yeah guys she is um getting ready um to come and take my mom to the hospital um i would like her to get checked out from that rib her knees you guys saw in the previous vlog they're really messed up one of them got sw more swollen last night and then i'm gonna check out the chipotle um, I was checking out, up on her throughout the night, you know, I mean, she's just here inside the house. But since we slept in our RV last night, I was just checking up and, you know, FaceTime and everything and she was doing good. She did take some Tylenol for the pain. But yeah, guys, um, I'll go ahead and update you guys in just a little bit. I'm going to go inside the house and, uh, you know, interview her a little bit to see how she's feeling and go from there. But um, for now, let me give you guys a little tour. Mom at 30. What, honey? Mom at 
She did? I didn't hear the alarm. Me neither. That's why I was like, what the hell? Oh. Yeah, she's saying that grandma left already. Um, I call her grandma because I girls call her grandma. You guys all know she's my mother. I'm going to go ahead and call my sister. Well, I already told her how it happened. But that's why we wanted to get the footage. That way we know exactly how it happened. This is a little tour of our second home on wheels. There's Missy. She was literally on the bed with me in the room. But she hasn't slept. Look at her pelo. Yeah, and she knows. She knows she's in trouble. <laughs> yeah, she didn't let me sleep. So this is where Willie sleeps, guys. He has his CPAP machine there. We have the projector to watch movies. They watch them. We have a TV, guys, but they watch the movies and a big screen there. Um. So yeah, the girl. This becomes into. This is our dining right here, but it turns into like a big king size bed. That's where all the girls sleep. Well, only three of them. Alicia too and then Ashley and I stay in the bedroom and Willie stays here. This is a sofa but it becomes into a bed. So yeah guys, um, Willie went to go make the coffee. I'm going to go ahead and help him out and drink our coffee here. It is a few hours later. It has 5.30. I have not gone back on here because uh, my sister took my mom to the hospital and they're still not back. She took her in the morning right after I blog um and we still don't have results they did a ct scan and x-rays mm, so i'm in touch with her over the phone but she ha they haven't told her the results so we're just waiting on that guys but meanwhile um willie made some bomb ass pizza like literally mm. so yummy huh daddy Yeah, he makes the dough. I did show you guys in the previous vlog. He had it. We were supposed to have some yesterday, but we ended up eating tacos instead. He already had the dough ready. So, yeah, he used it today to make some homemade pizzas, Willaton style. Era tanto allá. Bien campantes. ya te remangaste, da? You had some... He made a margarita first, guys. That's what the pizza is called, margarita. That's my plate right there. Um, Alizé had some right now as well. We're going to call Ashley over right now when the pepperoni is ready. Which one? Is that was her pepperoni and mushroom? Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, guys. So, he has a sauce there mixed with basil. That looks so, so yummy, Daddy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and he made me a drink with cinnamon. Really, really bomb, guys. I'll go ahead and get back on here and show you guys the yummy pizzas once he puts that one in the oven. And as soon as my mom gets here with my sister, I had her record a little bit in the hospital. I'm going to go ahead and enter that footage here so you guys could see how she's doing and then vlog when they get back from the hospital. Guys, my dad. It's like this. So, um, I'm gonna call a pepperoni. Oh my gosh. Pizza and beer. You cannot go wrong with some pepperoncinis here. Oh my gosh. So yummy. He's gonna cut it up. So yummy, honey. Chef Wilaton, if you guys didn't know. So yeah, we make the best pizza in town. I cannot go anywhere else in town to eat pizza because right away I could feel it. Everybody could feel it. There we go. Yeah, he makes the best pizza, guys. Literally. Oh. So she's going to go ahead and explain how it went at the hospital. Grandma's right there. She's doing okay. She's talking to someone on the phone telling them how it went. But... Um, so basically the doctor says she is fine. She's just very sore because of the fall. But, um, everything is fine. They did a CT scan on her head, her neck, just to make sure she wasn't bleeding from the inside. She did say her knees and her, her ribs were hurting. But, um, it's just the soreness. Um, she, um, her knee has to be replaced, but that's due to other stuff, not from the fall. So, um, the doctor did suggest that, um, she should get a knee surgery soon. So she needs to be off her knees for a little bit and, um, well, her legs. But she, um, she needs to go back to her doctor and... 
no more than three days and talk about that and how it can work well, to get a surgery and stuff like that. that. But other than that, she's good. She's still hungry, so that means yeah. she's good. <laughs> Ay, no, no se le quitó el hambre. No, pues si no se le quitó el hambre. And what you got going on good. right there and in that carola, I sister. Come. And of course, I got the best brother-in-law that cooks very, very good. Best wow, chef best chef so, in town. You guys are craving for pizza? Willow Don's Pizzeria is where you got it at. Oh yeah, but too bad it's not for sale. It's just for it's us. Only VIP. <laughs> yeah, but so yeah, that's guys. that's all they said. Yes, that's all they said. Um, she's she'll be fine. We still have a Paulina for a while. Ok, pues menos mal, ya me estaba preocupando. Yeah. Ya me estaba preocupando. Ok, Sissy. Thank guys. you for your services. You're welcome. It is the next morning. I just wanted to close out the vlog. I'm going to go ahead and give you guys an update. Here's Grandma. I brought her her food to the room. I made her coffee and I made her a burrito. Um, she's doing a lot better. Nothing is broken. Luckily, that's good but she is in a lot of pain so i'm gonna go to the pharmacy really quick i already dropped off the girls and everything i'm gonna go to the pharmacy and pick up her medication but this is a little update and the doctor did recommend like you guys heard my sister previously immediate surgery on her knee because um you guys saw in the other video she already had surgery in one of her knees which is uh es la derecha donde tienes la cirugía Uh -huh. So we already knew she needed surgery in the other knee. Um, it's been about four or five years that she got, or, yeah, like four years that she got surgery in her right knee. Um, she got a full replacement. So we knew she needs the surgery, but she was just scared. But I'm like, you know what? It's just going to get worse. And then it's going to go all the way to your hip. So might as well get it now. She did get the referral, guys, for whatever type of reason. They gave her the referral for the wrong knee, for the one that's already operated. So the doctor couldn't see her after they told my sister last night. Obviously, she she fell because she doesn't pick up her feet. Why doesn't she pick up her feet? Is because her knee hurts, so she doesn't bend the knee. So she's like literally dragging her feet. So it's to be expected, guys. Um, And she doesn't like to use her walker, but she's going to have to. I'm going to make sure of that because she cannot... I left her sitting down right now. You guys will see her because I'm going to go really quick to the store and she cannot be around the house. So she already got off the bed. I brought her breakfast right here. A burrito. And, oh, ya te lo acabaste. Diles cómo te sientes al blog. Me siento bien mal. Me duele todo. Parece que me pasó una cara pila encima. Oh, pero el... Oh, ya el chipote ya se te bajó, ¿verdad? Sí, pero todavía tengo... Un oh, sí. Ahí. Aquí no me puse de estar ni Yeah, guys. Everything still hurts, so I'm gonna go get her medication. Oh, I did want to mention um when Willie left to work before he left to work, it was like 3:30 in the morning. He woke me up. He's like, "Oh, go check up on your mom because she's like it, it sounds like she's in pain." So like uh, before four in the morning, I woke up and I guess she got off by herself um from the bed to the restroom and she couldn't get back up because her bed is pretty tall, guys. Literally, we need to fix that because she can't even lift her knee to go up there. We have to help her. She's like, yeah, go help her out because um, it seems like, you know, she's asking for help. I'm like, oh, shit. So I woke up at that time. I came to help her put her feet up. And then she took her medication at that time. But it seems that um, she needs more medication. So I'm going to run to the pharmacy really quick and update you guys because it's wearing out. And she needs it. But if you're not yet subscribed to Autism Royalty Family, make sure to do so. Hit that big thumbs up. The bell notification to get notified every time we upload a brand new video. I have my purse here, guys, because I'm on my way out. Really quick, like I said. But I will be recording um, the rest of the day for another vlog. But I wanted to close out this one. If you're not yet following the girls and everyone's channel, social medias, it's always in the description below. Make sure to give everyone a follow and subscribe if you're not already subscribed. We will be back tomorrow with another vlog.